<laughs> All right, so what we got today? Like in the in our previous video, I was talking about how I want to to compete again. I think I found my competition, and it's jujitsu. Wow. So I went to one class, like I think it was like two months ago, and I liked it. I enjoyed it actually, but I just never went back. Like it kind of, like I just forgot about it kind of. <laughs> Shit. Actually, I paid for like, so they have this thing, like you pay for the month and let's say you pay in the middle of the month, like the, the for the month is 150. So if you pay in the middle of the month, it's like, it, it gets shorter with time. So let's say it's 10 days before the month ends. So you pay like $40 and I did that. And I didn't even go. I'm doing it again because I actually liked it. You know, I like being around people. I like, you know, just get down dirty, baby. <laughs> so, and, and there's so much like, I've been seeing signs and, and synchronicities all over. Like there'd be people who come into the place I work wearing fucking like the, the jujitsu place shirts and shit. I always pass it on the way to work. I'm like, what if I did that? What if I did that? Well, I'm gonna do it. And who knows where it can take me? Like maybe from here I'll go to boxing or fucking some other shit. Who knows? So for any of you who are, who are like uh, on the ropes with making a decision, chances are you should just make it. Go with, go with the first thing you decided. You know, I've been stalling on this decision for like two months. The resistance was for real. It was for real. So, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna fucking do it. And I was creating these excuses, like my mind was creating these excuses like it wanted to play basketball or golf or tennis. I was like, what the fuck? If I wanted to do those things, which I love playing basketball and I love playing golf. I don't love playing golf, but it's fun. Like tennis, I never really played. But if I wanted to do these things, like for real, I would have done them already. You know, and I think something that also holds me back is like, I want to be like, I don't want to do something for fun. And that's like holding me that holds you back in a way. It, it's it's a good thing too, because it, it makes you want to be like great at something, but you don't have to be the best at at everything. You know, you don't have to be the best at everything. Like you can play golf whenever you want. You don't have to be the best. Like it, it's so cliche and, and cringe kind of <laughs> that, you know, that having fun is is a big thing. Like it's important. Like when when a fucking kid gets back from fucking uh, uh, fucking basketball practice and the, and the mom asks, "Did you have fun, honey?" and he's like, "Yeah, that's important because you're not gonna stick with it if you don't like it." You know, sometimes you have to do things even when you don't feel like it. But you know, when you when you make a, a long commitment, you have to enjoy it, or else you're just not gonna do it. Well, that's just some shit like, like school, <laughs> which you're fucking forced into. But anyways, yeah. So y'all gotta do this with me, bro. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We getting in this. You know, I've watched a couple of videos. Uh, Joko Willink. I never really watched him, but all of a sudden I just found out he's a big jujitsu guy. Joe Rogan, big martial arts guy. Uh, yeah. So I know I love it. I know. I gotta get the gi. I didn't know. And, and the first time I went there, I was like, <laughs> I told the guy, I was like, I never, I never even watched a, a jujitsu video. I went there literally knowing nothing. I was going up against a guy who, um, that was weird. I was going up against a guy who had been training for like four months and he, he fucked me. <laughs> he fucked me. 
I didn't know what I was doing. I was sparring on the first fucking day. I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. But he, but he, he didn't go hard on me. I mean, he went hard. Like I felt, it was, I didn't expect him to choke me like this. Like I didn't know what the fuck jujitsu was about. I thought we would be like, that was like boxing. I didn't even know. <laughs> it was like wrestling. I, I seriously didn't know. Uh, yeah, I gotta get the gi. I didn't know what a gi was, so I asked him. I was like, what "The fuck is a gi?" He was like, "Oh, the the thing that you wear." I was like, "Oh shit." <sighs> so yeah, that's where I am right now. Y'all having a good day? Have a good day. <laughs> and yeah, about competition. I think something that was interesting is like. When I, when at times in my life when I was a competitor, like it made me stick to the good habits more because I knew that I had to get the edge. So, so right now I've been fucking up with my habits and shit. So when I start competing, it's like, oh shit, I have to do the good habits because I don't want to fall off. I don't want to fall back. And that's hard to do because it like you're constantly ask you constantly are fucking pushing yourself, but it's a good thing. It's a good thing. So yeah. Uh love y'all. Peace.